welcome to day two of our Swiss Via Alpina Alpine adventure. Um, we came from Weistanen, which is that way. Um, we're currently on about 1400 meters elevation. Um, we're heading towards Fu Pass, which is that way. And we've got again about another 800 meters in elevation to reach that pass. Um, we're hoping to do a camp up near there tonight and uh, make our way down to Elm first thing in the morning. So stay with us, food passes that way. We are currently at around 1600 meters and it is steep all the way as you can see got about another two and a half hours hiking before we get to the food pass and around 600 meters more <laughs> but we're both feeling quite good actually we've done about 22 23 kilometers so far since yesterday and most of it's been up uphill so yeah we're doing all right quite surprised by a lot really <laughs> yeah awesome those views fantastic
And look at that, Brew River View. Hang on, there's more coming. Oh, oh my God. Hang on, we got no food. Oh, beat it. There's about six of them now, seven. Tell you what, you can't have a moment's peace. Jesus. Watch this, I'm going to eat your... Um, to eat your charge. <laughs> so I'm going to shoo him away or something. I don't know, we can't have a bit of peace in the back country. There's always one inquisitive one. Look. It's trying to chew Simon's um, solar char charger. Hang on, who's this now? Bloody hell, what do you want? Okay, come here. Come here. You just want a stroke, don't you? That's all. Just a stroke. You ain't chewing my hand though. No, I need them for my hiking poles. Ah. Go on, give me a moo. Go on, give me a, no, give me a moo. As you saw, we had um, about an hour and a half break back down there. Just um, had a coffee, dried the tent out, and just chilled out really. But not far off 2,000 meters. We got about another 270 meters to go, then we'll get to the food pass, and then we'll um, pitch up for the night. And then tomorrow we'll hike to Elm which is about a four hour hike from the food pass. So we're just following the, the Via Alpina trail up there. So let's see where it takes us. just come from up there and if I pan round I think I got the first glimpse of the Foo Pass and I think it's right by there that's the start of it deep is it? We just saw our first marmot and we could hear him screeching and it's over see the snow there just running across below the snow line we get a racket man really noisy 
We might see them up close actually. They're quite cute looking. Never know, we might see them. What a place. What an awesome place now. I don't think views get any better than this. Food pass is there, and that's the highest point of the day. reached the Fu Pass, 2,223 metres, and have a look at this. That is absolutely stunning. We're going to leave the Foo Pass now and start heading back down a little way and find somewhere to camp tonight and have a chill out for a few hours. That was a hard hike but worth it just for these views alone. Absolutely stunning.
we just got to Elm. We're trying to find the tourist information office and where we get our pass book stamped. I think it's round here somewhere. Just been talking to a couple up there. They spoke good English, so yeah. Um, hopefully we'll find it. Just leaving a little, little village of Elm back down there. And we decided to do the section we weren't going to do, and that is Elm to Lintel. We spoke to um, a few people back down there in the village, and they've said, even though there's snow there, hikers are getting through, and they reckon we should be fine. So we're going to give it a go. And the worst thing that can happen is we can get to the Rochette Pass and have to come back. But we're going to press on. We've got nine hours and ten minutes of hiking to do. Probably won't do it all today. Probably do three quarters, two thirds of it, and then camp up for the night and finish it off in the morning. Hopefully, we can do it.